we always talk about the, the strength of the Rock US Alliance. It's uh, one of the strongest, if not the strongest, in our alliance system. And Camp Humphreys is certainly the physical manifestation and realization of the partnership between us and the Republic of Korea. I've spent 13 years here in Korea. I've seen the growth over time. It's an honor to be a part of this effort to give the land back to the Korean community. It started with uh, the Republic of Korea and the United States coming to an agreement to, to build Camp Humphrey. So this is a $10.7 billion enterprise, largest transformation in the history of DOD. It's been talked about for years, and, and now it's, it's finally happening. It's been really amazing seeing the, you know, the transformation on post. Uh, when we first got here, there was one stoplight, and now there is, uh, you know, the whole post has you know, a major transportation system. I think it's a good thing. We have the land to accommodate for the people. We have the resources. You know, we have a large PX. We have a large commissary. The biggest one, I would say, in South Korea. As you look around the garrison, this really is a great place to serve and, and have your family. And our hope is that more soldiers choose to bring their families here. The original intent behind the consolidation efforts for uh, the garrisons were to uh, streamline resources in order to best provide services to the fighting forces. Over the last few years, we've gone from roughly 6,000 population to right now, I think we're at around 28,000. And so, you know, we just continue to grow. It's been uh, quite a, an enterprise to, to make this happen. For both governments, I believe there's a large cost savings as a result of it. The facilities that are down at Humphreys, they're state-of-the-art facilities. We built a garrison essentially from the ground up. But when you just think about the design effort, the engineering effort, I mean, what we're sitting on here was mostly rice paddies. You know, and I think with the planning effort and, and the years of looking at this and actually bringing it to fruition, it's hugely significant. And it's very significant for the Rocky US Alliance. It's the physical manifestation of both sides' commitment to our efforts here on the peninsula. I've got, you know, everything you could want uh, on this garrison. You really could spend your entire year here in Korea and never leave the garrison except maybe go train. And to me, that would be a, a, a waste of a good opportunity, right? So I tell the soldiers to get out, to see Korea, to experience the culture, and, and just get out and see Korea and see Asia, and don't waste the opportunity that the Army's giving you.